Or let's bring in Peter Striebel. He's chairman of Omni Hotels and Resorts. Peter, uh, we have to thank you for bringing this to us. And uh, please reveal, are people in shrimp or fruit and cheese mode these days? People are still in shrimp these days. It's been really great. You can always tell the corporations and how well they're doing from a profitability standpoint. Whenever they have their meetings and events at our hotels and resorts, when they add shrimp and they add raw bars, they add caviar and they add great brands of alcohol, that means the economy is really going well. On the opposite coin, when they start cutting things back and not having an appetizer and going with just fruit and cheese, we realize, oh boy, we're, we're up for some rough times. So right now that the corporations are spending, customers are spending, and everybody seems to be forging ahead with travel. No shrimp equals no good. All right, so what? what is, where is this demand coming from? Is it coming from private personal parties? Is it coming more from corporate events, uh, uh, team building exercises, those kinds of things? It's really coming from both, I would say. The corporate events are very, very strong. The number one reason why people are having meetings today is they're bringing their staff back together. You know, during COVID, they've been basically working from home. The whole morale issue of the corporate of America kind of went down with everybody not working in an office anymore. And I think now they're really trying to bring people together to meet each other, to learn from each other. So a lot of it has to do with, with corporations bringing people together. The other thing that's happening as well is it's also on the social side. People have been, you know, depressed during the COVID. Mm -hmm. They put off weddings. They had small weddings. Now, big is better. Uh, people want to get their friends together. People are traveling in packs. So there's much more entertainment going on on a social perspective as well. How, uh, how are you coping with inflation? And let me, let me ask it in a specific way. If I were to bring a group in, and you would normally say, three years ago, you would have said, okay, it's going to be 125 ahead. Uh, what would that price be today? Would it be 150? Would it be 175? What? Probably be about 25% to 30% higher than it was pre-COVID. Uh, so inflation has definitely happened. But our cost structures have basically increased. The wages of our associates have really increased from 19 we're about 30% out from wages from 19 now into 2023, mm. which I think is overall a good thing. Uh, working in a hotel is difficult. It's hard work. Uh, and I'm actually glad and happy that our associates are benefiting from these higher wages. All right, Peter, thank you very much. We appreciate it. Peter Strebel, we uh, of Omni Hotels. Thank you.